Hey everyone, this is Ty and welcome back to the channel. So today we are at White Lightning Harley Davidson to pick up my Lowrider ST. I had some tab performance slip-ons put on with the zombie baffles. I actually uh, got a ride here from Mrs. Cooper along with the puppies. So why did I have White Lightning put these on instead of me wearing? That's true, and also because I'm an idiot. So here's a story to tell. Stick around. Oh, yeah. God, this thing is so much louder. So I've been cruising down the road for a little bit with these new performance tab slip-ons. So I figured I would provide a little bit of commentary. So this video is definitely a first impressions and not a review. You can't do a review on the first day you've got something new. So I'm giving you my first impressions on these. Man, right from the start, they are loud. Listen to that, they are so loud. I mean, everyone has heard stock Harley exhaust. Everybody says it sounds like a sewing machine. I don't think it sounds bad, but it's definitely not my favorite. Nothing that I want to keep permanently on the motorcycle. But these really wake the bike up. Holy cow. Very deep, throaty type of bass sound to them. Hear that? I mean, man, they are so much louder compared to what I'm used to. Even the Reinhardts that I have on my Street Glide CVO, they are quite a bit louder than those even. And those are cannons on the back of that bike. But um, so yeah, these are very loud. You're gonna be able to hear them. Everybody around you is gonna be able to hear them. And uh, so far it was exactly what I was hoping for. So the opening of this video, I think I mentioned I was an idiot. That might have been the term that I was using. And my intention was, for these tab slip-ons, was to do a nice little video and, you know, a how-to, put them on type of thing. Well, that didn't work out. I was in the garage. I got the first stock muffler off, no problem at all. Went for the second one, used my Allen wrench to turn uh, one of the screws, and bam, it broke right off into the screw. Now, for somebody who is very mechanically inclined, something like that is not a big issue, especially if you have the tools. Well, in my garage, in my limited tools, my limited capacity of my knowledge of tools, I just could not get that thing out of there. My son even came and helped me, and he knows a lot more about this stuff than I do. He could not get it out of there. So I had to take it over to White Lightning, and uh, have them remove that bolt and I said you know what guys while you've got it just go ahead and put the slip-ons on and they did that for me uh, because they're awesome and I'm very appreciative of their of their time also I had these flow adjustable leather the uh, levers uh, installed see that can you see that super cool getting used to those full review coming up on down the road nothing on those today just the stock exhaust or just the Reinhardt good lord just the tabs exhaust on these is what we're going to be talking about today uh oh lady watch yourself man you hear those from a stop sign they just god they are so awesome <laughs> now here's one of the things that I'm wondering about I live in a neighborhood that has an HOA and I hate HOAs I don't like anybody telling me what I can and can't do with my own property so probably somebody in our neighborhood will complain about these pops but you know what the HOA can suck it. I love these things and I'm planning to wake my neighbors up on a regular basis 
You know, one of the things I just thought of, I haven't shown you guys the uh, exhaust on this motorcycle yet. So let's do the thing that everybody else does. We're going to pull in over here. Give you guys a quick look at these tab performance slip-ons and maybe do a few drive-bys. All right, this looks like a good as place as any. Let's just stop over here and we will take a look at the newest modification to this Lowrider ST. All right, y'all, here's a look at the tab performance slip-ons with the zombie baffles on this motorcycle. I mean, you guys have heard of, as I've been riding around, they sound so good. They're so loud. I know you can't see, but man, if you were to look in there, it's just a straight shot all the way through. It's just almost completely bored out. But they look awesome and they sound fantastic impressions would be these slip-ons are 500 bucks and man I would say they're worth every stinking penny the motorcycle sounds so so good and uh, for $500 that is a pretty inexpensive option compared to a lot of the other exhaust systems that are out there so if you are thinking about getting the tab performance with the zombie baffles Pull the trigger and rest assured, I think you'll love it. I know that I do on these. And man, I hope to get a lot, a lot of enjoyable miles on this motorcycle. Well, I know this video has been a bit different than a lot of the other slip-on videos that are out there. So I hope you have enjoyed your time with me today. Thank you very much for carving out a little bit of your day to spend time with me. If you guys would, please like and subscribe. I would appreciate that so very much. I hope you guys have an excellent day, and we'll talk to you again soon.